<laughs> Hello. Welcome to the Little White Seeker channel, where we go through the beginner's Bible with weekly lessons, followed by a quick, fun craft or activity after. My name is Miss Shannon, and today's story we are going to learn about Abraham and the great faith he had to have when leaving his old home behind to find a brand new home with his family. So let's dive into today's lesson so that we can get going and creating after. A new land. There once was a good man named Abraham. God had a special plan for him. God told Abraham to move to a new land. So Abraham left the place where he lived. He packed up everything he had, his tents, his dishes, his clothes. He gathered all his animals and he went to a new land that God showed him. Abraham's wife, Sarah, and his nephew, Lot, went with him. Abraham and Lot also brought along their helpers to take care of the animals. But there was a problem. Abraham's helpers and Lot's helpers were always fighting. Abraham said to Lot, let's not have all this fighting. You take your helpers and choose a new place to live and I will take my helpers and move to a different land. Lot chose first. He took the best looking land for himself. It had plenty of water and grass for his animals. Abraham moved his animals and his family. He set up his tents near the big trees at Hebron. God made a promise to Abraham. He said, you will have so many children and grandchildren and great grandchildren that no one will be able to count them. And all the land that you see right now will be yours. Wow. Can you imagine leaving your entire home behind and going somewhere completely unknown because God told you to? I mean, look around you, look in your own home. What would you bring? Talk to your parents. What would you bring and why would you bring it? That's the kind of faith that Abraham had to have when he left his home behind to just start walking, to go where God told him to go, somewhere completely unknown. He didn't know that he was gonna be blessed for generations and generations behind him. He just knew God needed him to move and he did. Do you think we can have that faith today in our own hearts and our own families that if God told us to get up and move, would we? I hope we can. But today we are going to build our own home within our home. We are going to need some pillows, some blankets, and maybe a table or some chairs. It's something that you can create a really nice new home with. So gather those materials and let's get going. I hope you enjoyed building that new home and really figuring out that great faith that Abraham had to have of leaving his old home behind to follow God's plan. If you like these videos, don't forget, it, forget to give it a big thumbs up, subscribe and share with your friends so that we can put God back in the center of our hearts, in the center of our homes, and we can be those shining lights out in the world today. So thanks for watching and see you next week when we learn more about Abraham and the family God created for him. <laughs>